well, Pura means providing urban amenities in the rural area. Uh, it is uh, for India. Uh, we are proposing about uh, seven thousand puras uh, for various terrain. There will be a hill pura, there will be a coastal pura, there is a plain pura, and there is a um, there is a, the four types of puras are there. So this uh, we we have estimated seven thousand puras are uh, required for the country. Um, now. The pura means providing urban amenities rurally, as I said. It uh, it has got four uh, four connectivities: a physical connectivity, electronic connectivity, knowledge connectivity, leading to economic connectivity. Now, this uh, we have seen. We have worked with also some puras in the country, uh, started by educational institution, started by medical institution, uh, started by. The the, uh, the a great uh, uh, social uh, reformer. Uh, so all these things we studied together. Then we found uh, the uh, how do we take prosperity of the at least the so-called prosperity in the urban area, and uh, also ensure that prosperity comes uh, without damaging the rural environment. Because the rural environment has got certain unique uh, environment is not a damaged mostly, uh, and also rural environment has got a unique core competence. If, for example, in fishing, there is a core competence, or it may be agriculture core competence, or craftsmanship it will be core competence, or even tourism. So we are trying to see we want to base Pura on the core competence of the cluster of villages, fifty villages. Population about fifty thousand to hundred thousand people, uh, so that how do you bring integrated way prosperity to the core competence, value value uh, where adi, adding technology to their core competence, so that productivity will be more, and then the education they will go, then the healthcare they will take care of, and then in the societal function to be uh, improved, they good citizens, good earning capacity. This is what we are doing.